What is going on today? We're back in today. Playing some more Madden 24 online head to head. Today we're back, and today we have some more off season news to talk about. So, without further ado, let's get into it. We have a couple pieces of news, and one slash two big pieces of news. So let's get into it. The first piece of news comes from the San Francisco 49ers. The San Francisco 49ers have decided to release corner uh, Isaiah Oliver for cap room. So Isaiah Oliver is uh, released from San Fran as an officially a free agent. The next piece of news comes from the Pittsburgh Steelers. The Pittsburgh Steelers have decided to release center Mason Cole, another member of their O-line, as they already released uh, Presley Harvin, their punter, and Chukawuma Okafora, their right tackle. Now they release their starting center. And then just another uh, cap dump. And now the main part of the reason, uh, sorry, the main reason why we made this video, the two big pieces of news come from this team right here, the Miami Dolphins, 86 across the board, 86 offense, 86 defense, cool. Cool. So yeah, the Miami Dolphins is the team that we're talking about today. My record going into this, by the way, is a 43 and uh, 60. So let's get into it. Alliance user, okay. guy gonna play or what's going on here so the Miami Dolphins have released two star players on their defense to hit free agency and we're gonna talk about it EA Sports coverage of the NFL brings us to South Florida and Hard Rock Stadium here in Miami coming up we got a good matchup on tap here as it'll be the Detroit Lions taking on the Miami Dolphins the two players that the Miami Dolphins released, they released defensive end Emmanuel Ogba. Here's Jason and they have already came out and said that the first day of the new season, they are going to release their number two corner, Xavier Howard. So Emmanuel Ogba and Xavier Howard have technically been released by the Miami Dolphins. They will be on new teams both next year. So I thought we could play both their last games as of Miami Dolphins. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. Xavier Howard's going to be a big loss for them. He was their best defensive player before, uh, you know, Jalen Ramsey got to the team. So he'll be a, a big loss for them, cover through cloud, but they don't have enough money. And that is probably going to play a big factor is they can't have two big corners. Nice. Jerome Baker. Outside zone. But yeah. Let's do it, baby. Now HN on first and ten. Devon HM. Red zone up. Oh, come on, Durham. Outside zone. Here we go. Tennessee. We don't need to mention the other guy's name, but when he dropped an open pass that you blew coverage on, what'd you say to him? Yeah, it's really not right since I blew coverage, but since he dropped the pass, I said, well, maybe next time I'll just walk it out here and hand it to you. Would that be easier? He wasn't real, th he wasn't real thrilled with that. Real switch. <laughs> there we go. 
Looked like he was trying to bounce it outside, but no success. Yeah, sometimes you got to just figure out where you're going to go, and sometimes you just have to take it to another spot. And trying to get it outside, the defensive pursuit was there and just ran him down. Now, it would definitely be a disappointment to come out of this starting position with just three points. They need to try to dial something up now, third and ten. I wasted too much time, bro. Take your three. Can this guy's fucking, like, can you not lag, bro? Take my fucking three. That might be a miss. Yep. Oh, my God. Fuck. Get it back. Should be... Get it back, bruh. Let's go. The fuck was that kick, bruh? That fucking meter is so stupid. All right, a win is a win is, I guess. Bro quit. We're going to run it back, though. That's going to improve my record to 44 and 60. Let's run it back with the Dolphins. Here we go. Oh, he's also a Dolphins user. Yeah, no thanks. Not facing a fucking another same team as me, bruh. Okay, Vikings. I can do Vikings. There we go. EA Sports coverage of the NFL brings us to South Florida at Hard Rock Stadium here in Miami. Straight ahead, we've got a pretty good one on tap here. As it'll be the Minnesota All right, let's go. Vikings. We have ball now. The Miami Dolphins. Here we go. The Florida Atlantic man, Greg Joseph, ready to get this one started. And we are I'm running it back. From Miami. Hill is going to take it out of the end zone. And he will be brought down here inside the 20. Good coverage as he's dropped at the 17. And they're on the 17-yard line. HB stretch. PA post curl shot. And they gave up no cutback angle. You know he was trying to dart through. No place for him to go. A nice job there, only giving up a three yard gain. They faked the handoff. Now Tua out to his left. They'll let this go deep for Waddle. And that's going to Holding, I'm assuming. Oh, illegal contact. Take that. So they'll accept that penalty and PA that crossers. The football up the field. I thought that was going to be holding. That's why, I, but I didn't know. Like on play action, here's Tua eluding the pressure right. Nice. This shit, Durham. Durham Smythe. HP counter SDR. That 
one good for 13 and a Dolphin first down. Here we go. Running the counter with Moster. Oh. Oh, he's got some breathing room. And he'll be out of bounds. It's a monster. PA post cross. For 22 and a first down. We often poke a little fun at running backs past the age of 30. Oh, they're getting old. They can't run anymore. What he's showing past the age of 30, you can still have some nice runs like that. You certainly can. And I think that we're starting to expand our definition of old running back. Because it used to be as soon as they hit 30, we want to get rid of these guys Ooh. and go to the younger guys. But now All right, good shit, Jalen Waddle. Care of themselves, as you pointed out. You can still get explosive runs at HP stretch. That one goes for 30 yards. We expected this defense to be tested by this passing game Ooh. coming into this one. And there's an example on this first position. I feel like I should run game. it this side. On first and 10, it's Moster. And he'll get about four All right. Outside zone. That's not a run that about, but still, a good first down run. That's what an offense calls staying on schedule. Three to four yards on first down. You're set up very well for the rest of the drive. Come on, H hand. Right at the five yard line. Give him two on the play. We talk about defenders, specifically linebackers, keeping their eyes in the right spot. And he slot under. The entire time. And you know that's not easily done because they throw a lot of misdirection. And hit HM maybe. You and get your eyes in the wrong place. But you're right about that one. He correctly figured that one out and made a really nice play. That's on. Oh my god. Braxton Barrios. What a dot by two of the Barrios. There was no going through the progressions on that touchdown pass. Let's go, baby. His receiver won that route early, presented himself. No reason to wait. Go ahead and put it on him and score a touchdown. There we go. Seven nothing. Extra point up and good by Sanders. And that makes the score seven nothing. <laughs> Now after the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Sanders. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. Cover on all. Cousins and the Vikings with a first and 10 at their 25-yard line. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. Good hit. Completes it to the fullback hand. And not much to speak of. Call it a one yard gain up to the 26. Brandon, to me, what's important right here on this drive is for them to get at least two first downs. They've got to give their defense a chance to settle down. Cover six, show two. A little bit after they give up a touchdown on the opening drive. Now Cousins here on the bootleg. Wow. Finds his man. There's Jordan Anderson. After the catch, gonna net him 23 in a first. Kind of a dangerous throw there. He's Cover nine, show two. He gets rid of it. But this is all about a quarterback knowing what he can get away with. And that time, it turns into a completion and a healthy gain as well. well they'll run it here. Nice, Bradley Chubb. On this one, it may need to go back to the drawing board. He's gonna be swallowed up right away. Bradley Chubb came in and got him. That's the danger, Charles, of running plays like this for your wide receiver. They can hit big or they can be duds. Yeah, you're exactly right about that because if they're forced to try and go around defenders behind the line of scrimmage, sometimes you can give yardage in order to gain it. But in this case, they all. gave yardage and didn't get it back. Now they contend with a second and 12 after the Here we loss. go. On play action, Cousins. Pick that. Jalen Ramsey. Picked up by Jalen Ramsey. Down the right sideline. Touchdown. Jalen Ramsey. That's what you get apparently when you try to take on a pro bowl cornerback. And what a play there to make the interception and also bring it back for six. 
Good shit, Jalen. We've seen teams absolutely stay away from throwing the ball at him. Here he's just reading the quarterback's eyes the entire way, makes a great play on the football, and turns it into six. Sanders going for the extra point. Boom. 14 nothing. And it's good, and they have jumped out here to a quick 14 nothing first quarter lead. Back of the end zone for a touchback. All right, let's go, baby. <laughs> Cover six. Try to get one more in here before the quarter breaks. Look at Jalen, bro. Where Jalen's fired up. Cousin. Nice hit, Xavier. And he will be out of bounds. End of the first quarter. Now to be the final play of this first quarter. 14 nothing the score. This is the NFL on EA Sports. Let's go, baby. Cover six. They'll come up now, second and four from the 31. They'll go Madison nice up the hit. middle, and he'll be tackled at about the 35. They give him about four on the play, but he's marked short. Cover so six. About the length of the football. They'll try to get it on the ah. ground with Madison. It's All right. a four there, and it gives him a new set of downs. I don't know about you, but that almost felt like old time football Cover six. There. Third and two is not necessarily just a running down anymore. A lot of times they want to throw the ball. They went back to the roots and powered forward and got the first down. Here's Madison running on first down. Right, good hit. He'll get a nice chunk there on the first down run, and it's second and four. From the lineman to the guy running with it, that was a well-executed first down by the offense with two shots left to get Cover on all. You can get a little aggressive here on second down if you want and try for some bigger yardage. They'll try to throw now, Cousins. Get that. Or don't. This one can play to his fullback out of the backfield. Fucking Jalen Phillips, Seven fucking idiot. There at a first down. It's pretty easy to overlook the fullback. Cover on Robert. Assigned this defensively in the pass coverage game, but in this case, they made him pay for that oversight and picks up a nice game. Now we give to Madison. Wow. Good hit, good hit, good hit. down right around the 41 yard line. It's a seven yard carry to set them up with a second and three. That's a strong pickup right there on first down. And as this drive goes on, we're Cover seeing an six. offensive line and running game imposing its will. From the 41, here's second and three. Going to run with Madison again. And yeah. he'll be inside the 35 now at the 34 yard line. Six yards to pick up, and that's a first down. I'm okay with the call there. In fact, I actually like Cover it. Cover on Robert. Down a couple of scores. Nope, two minute warning. But the running game worked in that situation. I would continue to go in that direction. Cover on Robert. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. On the handoff, oh it's Madison. Good hit. And he works his way free all the way down to the outskirts of the red zone. 41 yards rushing for him now on just six carries to this point. He finds his way into the secondary again on this drive. They might How want to try getting him to one. closer to the line of scrimmage. Yeah, what do they call that? Third level run, first level being the D line, and linebacker second level in the secondary, the third. 
When you block it up well, you make the secondary do all the tackling. Pick that. that will wear on it. Thank you. Oh, it's intercepted. A drive killer there. Pick Xavier Howard. Xavier Howard. And the Dolphins will take over here at their own 14 yards. I got stuck up on my fucking man. It's fine. Did, got over the 50 -yard line. Don't you think that Post wheel drag. I think he needs to get with his coaches on the sidelines, make some immediate adjustments, and that's what you do. You don't wait. You do it from series to series. Because drives like that, the end with a turnover, that's multiple times they picked him off already in this opening half. The Dolphins at the Here we go. Ready for their next Watch drive. this, Tyree Kill. And now consider the lead. The question is, how much is good enough? Are you going for more? Fuck. There's never enough, I believe. I misread it. Inside post up. I think that they will try and move the ball downfield, try and squeeze a few more points. I really want to hit a Tyree kill half, deep ball be careful, on this fucking guy. At times, but also, they will attack downfield nope. and try and get in position for at least three points. Is shit Braxton? HP Swift screen. A gain of 28 yards there and give him the first down. Yep. To a good a throw. I thought he was not going to get that. Oh. Kill call time on HB wheel. Alright. Yeah, like this. Here's Tongue of Iloa to throw. It's a Tyreek. by Tyreek Hill. And this is going to turn into another first down as the tackle is made. All right. The Dolphins going to take a second timeout. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we head toward halftime. Got to get out of bounds here. Tua setting up shop to throw again. He's gonna let this go. Get that Barrios. Oh. Good try. Good try. Good try. Good try. They were maybe hoping for a little bit of a back shoulder fade there. That's a play that's been in vogue the last Will. few years in all aspects of football. But they couldn't get the hook up there. Yeah, there you go. Two and once again here on second and ten. The Vikings after him, and they get there I had to call timeout because I got fucking sacked. Fucking idiot. Out levels. Tyree kills one on one. Watch this. No, he's not. And I can't do anything. A good pickup, but it will come on what yeah. should be the final play in the first go out of bounds. Let's fuck there. All right, doesn't matter. We're up 14 nothing at halftime. Two quarters down. Two still remain. We step aside. This is the NFL on EA Sports. If I didn't take that fucking sack on, uh... If I didn't take that fucking sack, I would have been in a better spot, but... It's fine. Welcome back. Halftime over. We are ready for quarter it's fine. It's okay. number three. We're up 14 of them. Davis, Xavier Howard has a pick. Let's go, baby. Jalen Ramsey has a pick six. Alright. Better late than never. Better late than. Cover on all. Here are the Vikings now to start their next drive. Here we go. Charles, it'll be interesting to see what adjustments this offense made in the locker room. Haven't really been able to get anything going. Fucking hell. Virtually nothing in the ground attack either. Are you? So certainly okay. Has to change Take a shit, Bradley Chubb. Three. And I'm pretty sure their friends from the defensive side of the ball told them exactly that because those guys, the stop troops, they've been playing pretty well. Cover six. Them around in this game. Now they got some time. The running game struggled in the first half. Opposition knows how to focus on defending the pass here. They've got to re-energize that ground game and maybe open things That's up for the comeback here in this half. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. 
They suspected that it was a power play up the middle coming at them, and boy, were they right. That defense Cover got downhill in a hurry and limited them to just a couple on first down. Play action now, Cousins. All right, bro. What are you doing, Jalen Rams? Why are you diving, bro? That was nowhere near you. Cover on hole. Maybe this can give him a little bit of a spark because they're not out of this game by any stretch. Going on the ground with Matt. That's it. And they'll bring him down after just a short pickup. On the tap of there, Zach Sealer out of Ferris State. Well, sometimes you just have to give credit to the defense. Great job there at the point of attack, holding up. They won their battles at the Cover on robber. Scrimmage. Left him no space to try and run. A really nice job swarming to the ball carrier. Cousins now. Okay, bro. What are you doing, fucking Jerome Baker? First target, first catch at a first down. Cover six. What they talked about at halftime, whatever it was, it worked. They look like a different team here in the third quarter. Yeah, I doubt that there are very many trash cans that got kicked over that type of a speech. I think what they did was they analyzed what worked in the first half, what didn't, and figured out a better game plan. They will right. get four yards here on the first down run, and that'll make it second and six. And that was a quality play to start a new set of downs. Cover six. Offensive line winning the battle up front. And wing in a big way and giving their guy in the back. Bro's wasting the whole quarter. Here's Madison getting it again on second. Nice hit. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. I see a shake of the head as he gets up, and you've got to cover two men. Thinking, guys, you got to help me out. He's hoping his team can read his thoughts because he definitely needs some assistance. On third down, Cousins. Wow. Okay, bro. And he'll go out of bounds inside the 15 yard line. Uh, Second catch for him today, and it'll wind up a first down. And this was a nice example Number of the six. offensive coordinator scheming his guy open, just a little underneath route, just trying to free up some space. And it worked awfully well. Got him not just space, but plenty of room to run after the catch to pick up really nice yardage. Pick that. Oh, come on, bro. There's three of you. Weak blitz one. Nice sack. Bradley Chubb. Just when the offense seemed to be figuring things out, they have a little bit of a setback there. Part of getting a drive going. They can't cover six invert. Especially since they've been shut out this far in. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Oh wow, that's a touchdown. And it's caught in the end zone. Because Javon Holland can't guard Justin Jefferson. Justin Jefferson. A 24 yard touchdown. And the Vikings are able to get a score back in wow. the final stages of this third quarter. I don't know what the fuck Javon Holland was That's doing the there, but felt they had to have here in the third quarter to get back in this game. And you know that there was an emphasis on their side. Okay. We know this. We know where we are. But sometimes that binds you up so much that you try too hard, you don't get the score. A perfect combination of urgency, yet relaxed enough to get it done. Joseph connects on the extra point, and that'll make our score 14 to 7. Basically wasted the entire third quarter, so. Now Joseph tees it up to kick off following the touchdown. Oh, yeah, thank you. Hill is going to take it out of the end zone. Fuck! I literally just needed to beat that guy, and I would have been gone. Fuck. PA cross. Literally just needed one more guy to beat, and I would have been gone. 
first down Miami as they get set to start the drive. This is going to go for big, I'm telling you right now. Renewed pressure on this unit following the touchdown a moment ago. It's back to a one score game. And because of that pressure, because it's not okay. a one score game, game of the third quarter. they know this is where you need to slow the momentum change because otherwise that could overrun your team. You've got to be careful right here. Back now in Miami. HB Blast. We couldn't ask for much more to this point in the second half. A gorgeous day. One score game. First and ten here. I should have just cut more inside. Now he is going to be stopped okay. cold behind the line of scrimmage. Tight end angle. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. At the 48-yard line. Now Tua. Flush to his right. <laughs> You're an idiot. I I got away with it. I got away with it. I got away with that one. And just threw it right at the guy, but he didn't catch it. He swatted it down. Thank God. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means he'll need to come up with something here on third down. Off a play action, tug of Iloa. Fuck off, you stupid fuck. Punt the football. Jonathan Bullard with a big time sack on third down. It's a loss of seven. Oh my god. What are we doing, guys? Why are you calling play action? That My fault. Bite defensively, right? No, not at all. I did have a coach explain to me years ago that for some teams, that's how they have to deal with pass protection and their line blocking. But to me, it seems silly. Yeah, well, they're silly, and it leads to a play action. Silly. How? How does that do that? I put backspin on it. It hits at the four and continues into the end zone. It's a touchback. Okay. I'll just get a stop here. Cover one hole. The Minnesota offense about ready to get this next drive underway. And it feels like the momentum has shifted. They scored, and their defense forces the hit. last punt. And now a chance to tie the game on this possession. Tackle that time by Jerome Baker. Cover two Ohio men. State. From the 22, here's second and eight. To throw, Cousins. Out to the left there and complete right. to the tight end, Hawkinson. And he'll be corralled right around the 34. 12 yards there, first down. Weak blitz one. Here's Madison. Wow. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. 61 yards rushing on okay, 12 bro. carries for him now. We'll definitely see some open running lanes, and he's taking advantage of it right six. now. But that shouldn't be a surprise. Defense has the lead. They're playing for the pass first. They go play action. Cousins. This goes out good hit. from Madison. And that'll be good for eight yards to the 45. That'll be the two-minute warning. Looked like a pretty good, safe play right there. No, Come he's had trouble with the interceptions in this game there. Hits his guy out in the flat. Yeah, so many times we hear quarterbacks and offensive coordinators talk about Cover on hole. in your progression, you're either throwing the touchdown or you're throwing the check down. But earlier in the game, it was touchdown or interception. Now he got to the check down. A nice safe throw and a good one. Go come on. Runs over. Fuck off, bro. How do we not tackle him behind the line? Behind the line. Weak blitz one. Second and two is prime time for a little bit of a gamble, isn't it? Open up the playbook. Go play action. Toss that bad boy deep. But in this situation. Go ahead and give it to your back. Nice head. And he'll be brought down, losing yardage back at the 40. Cover two men. Pick that. Thank you. Oh, and that's gonna sabotage the that's game. Two pick sixes by Jalen Ramsey. Not the 
That's two for Jalen, baby. Boom. 21-7. Their attack was one of the best in the league the prior season. Extra point up and good by Sanders. And it's now 21-7. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. Oh, he's got fielded it. right at the goal line. And his guys will get the football right at the 20 yard line. Cover two men. Here's first and 10. After the pick six, they go right back to the air. Nice. And his throw no P.I. Incomplete. Yeah. But they've certainly had trouble unlocking this defense through three and a half quarters. So I don't Cover expect them to get any easier now. You know they're going to be sitting back and waiting on everything, and they force an incompletion there. Second down, Cousins again. Nice hit, Andrew Van Ginkle. Just inside the 10, back at the 9. Sacked by Andrew Van Ginkle. Cover on Robert. Defensive coaches always say, guys, you got to earn the right to rush the passer. But they put themselves in a great spot with this big lead, and they know they've got to throw the ball. These pass rushers have to be salivating. It is pin your ears back time indeed. Oh my god. Again. <laughs> Javon Holland! That's three pick sixes in this game, baby. I thought that was Jalen Ramsey again. That is Javon Holland. Charles, that pick six, that's, that's kind of the cherry on top. Yeah, they did it. And I feel like they're quoting a bad movie line, but they did it together, didn't they? Boom. Fed off of each other. Every big play they 28 7. Dolphins defense carried this game. I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to try and uh, do the uh, onside thing. So leave that. High kick it. Right there. Right there. Then did the Dolphins get it? Yes! Yeah! It worked! Well, it go. fucking Just worked, baby! Big and the onside kick it with a lead. They got it. I mean, it worked. It worked! It fucking worked! Oh my god, that's the first time I've ever fucking done that. And it's not only just to try and increase their lead, but that's their way of saying we're in full control of this game and we can kind of do what we want. The Dolphins at the line ready for their next drive. Uh, CD, this is the ideal situation in the fourth quarter. You come out here late, not much time on the clock with a comfortable lead and put the final nail in the coffin. Yeah, this offense, all game long, they've been okay. powerful. They've been it's dangerous. You're exactly right. They can end this one on their own terms. Well, fourth quarter with a three-score lead here, Charles, but they're still going back to the air and looking for more points. Well, with this game well in hand, it's an opportunity for the guys to come off the bench and get a chance to play. And a lot of coaches, they want to run their full playbook no matter who's on the field. Okay, no PI. Second down, and this one incomplete as well. I think it's fairly safe to call this game over, but they're still trying to bomb it downfield and add to their lead. Almost makes you start to feel for the defense and root for them a little bit, too. Now the Dolphins going to burn the first of their timeouts. That'll leave them with two remaining. We'll be back after this. Now they face a third and ten after back-to-back -back incompletions. Hot route. Tyree Kill sent him on a streak. There we go. Now a play fake. Here's Tonga by Loa. Fuck! I didn't have time. No. The Dolphins going to take their second timeout. That'll leave them with just one remaining in this fourth quarter of play. And with things looking pretty good on the scoreboard, they're going to keep the offense out there and go for it here on fourth. All right. Thank you. Able to find the open man. That's complete. And he's going to be out of bounds, but not before. 
before he takes it inside the 40. Fourth down conversion plays, you usually think one, two, three yards, maybe ten. Not there. What a huge pickup. Stutter guys. The sticks make a drastic shift forward. So how about that yeah, for a yeah, chain yeah. mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and ten. That one looks like he'll throw here. He Get that. This one Get that. Toward the back of the end zone. Oh, Tyreek. We'll go one more time. Oh, that's some good closing speed there defensively because that looked open for a minute. But that's great work with the ball in the air. Never gave up. Converged on his man and broke the play up. He's gonna let this go. Back of the end zone. No PI. Come on. Fine, I'll take the game. I'll take it. 28 to 7 win, baby. Let's go, Dolphins. I wanted to bomb to Tyreek in the end zone. They looked like a smooth operation in this one, didn't they? Because you look at every facet of the game, they handled their business. Offense took care of the football, converted it into points. Defense right, cool. took the ball away, gave it back to the offense. Alright, so hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you're new. And until the next video, I'll see you guys when I see you guys. Peace.